time for You Wanted to Know. The last time we asked, do you want to know why people in Latrobe can't agree on how to pronounce their town's name? Is it Latrobe or Latrobe? There's a good reason for the confusion. Or do you want to know about the Pittsburgh Police Motorcycle Unit and why they have those sidecars? Well, with 75% of the vote, the motorcycle unit is the winner. So I suited up to take a ride. wonder why Pittsburgh police motorcycles have sidecars? The answer is as unique as the group itself. Pittsburgh got their first motorcycle unit in 1909, and we have ridden Harley Davidson's continuously since. While using Harleys has remained the same, a lot else has changed. In the 50s, the uniform included a leather hat and bow tie. In the 60s, they changed over to helmets. The late 80s saw the largest number of motorcycle cops, a total of 60. Nowadays, there are 23. Maintaining traffic flow is their beat, and the unit is at the forefront of major events. The Pens Parade, escorting politicians, protests, and on movie sets. Members of the unit are out 365 days a year. First day, the lieutenant told me, he said, there's two rules. He said, uh, if I ride, everybody rides, and rule two was I ride every day. It's a rite of passage to get your picture taken under the time and temperature display at this bank on the North Shore. You get some strange looks when you're riding and it's 10 degrees out and you're wearing uh, ski goggles and a balclava covering your face. Uh, people kind of look at you strange and say, are you really riding in this kind of weather? Ready? Which brings us back to that sidecar. I got a chance to take a spin around the block in it. Have you ever had anybody besides me in your sidecar before? I actually have not. <laughs> You're the first. So is this for capturing and bringing in bad guys? Not really. Stability only, uh, so we don't fall over any ice and snow. Yes, they only use the sidecars in winter months to give them better balance. And as for what's inside, well, they're often a suitcase for supplies. Boots rain gear, rain jacket, another extra jacket, rain pants, basically everything you could think of under the sun in case something really went wrong. And it is very competitive to get into that motorcycle unit. They accept one or two riders each year, if that. It was cool to see you in the sidecar. <laughs> what was it like? It was fun, but we definitely got a lot of weird looks. Well, it's Susan Copen in the sidecar. <laughs> I would look.